And so, for one last grind, we will begin Final Fantasy V for Job Fiesta. The most recent save. Hmm. One last time. One last go. Can I get this to work? It is on. So... It is grind time! It appears not to be working. That's fine. I was trying some... simple things. This would also help uh, strengthen the chicken knife, which is um, which is very good. So this is a grind for not just our numbers, but for chicken knife, because it won't let us escape X death, which means it'll only lose occasional turns. But it is an amazing knife, and I also read up on what's considered great places to grind in World Three, and uh, we don't have access to them. The big one is the Underwater Trench, the Great Sea Trench. Uh, that doesn't open up until after Fork Tower, which we are not doing Fork Tower. Fork Tower is for the uninitiated. For the uninitiated, Fork Tower is a double dungeon that houses the Greatest white and dark and black magic, holy and uh, flare, and are the only known locations of either in the game. And it's you have to split your four person party into two a physical and a magic party. And while technically we could do it with berserkers, uh, the boss with there just needs bigger numbers, I think. But the big thing is, we don't have the Reflect Ring necessary to take on the uh, Magic Boss. Um, so we would be quite literally unable to do anything at that point. So we have now... We do have another Haste Ring capable. Good. This is good. We are very good. Now we just need to purchase the ring. And of course, do some grind later. Maybe we could do something with Phoenix Tower, but it's unlikely that that's going to be another thing we could do. Um, there's just not a lot we can do because we're not taking on Fork Tower. Um, I don't even think we could do... Well, we could. We could maybe... Maybe do... Maybe do the waterfall? I don't believe the waterfall requires... It may require us to do Fork Tower as well. Which, again, is unfortunate. Regardless, uh, what we need is just actually bigger numbers and to hit faster and harder. Which is why the Hermes Sandals. I didn't make it abundantly clear. Uh, we are going to be doing it under the effect of the Flame Rings with the Hermes Sandals still equipped. And I think that'll work. Uh, do not quote me on that. The cutscene may do some stripping of unfortunate things. I'm not exactly sure. It is, uh... It's not a bug I'm horribly familiar with.
In fact, considering it was just found last year, it, it's not surprising. Which means I believe this bug exists in all versions of the game. Um, which not all the bugs continue to exist per release. The mobile or Steam version, uh, for example, has a bug, has the quick leak bug fixed. Um, which is unfortunate because you could, in theory, quick leak X death to death. In fact, I know I've followed someone who did that as a charity thing, not for Fiesta, I believe, but for the charity that Fiesta supports. That the uh, Fiesta supports. He quick leaked all the bosses, all Omega, Shinryu, and Ned, um, in one stream. Although I think he did Omega and Shinryu in their own because they're much smaller health-wise, and I think he played through he played through most of Final Fantasy One on the NES and got like three quarters of the way through the game before Ned died. It was a very meta. Very meta stream. It was uh, it was brilliant to be honest. I enjoyed it thoroughly. Okay, that's just not happening. <laughs> I've got a feeling, and yeah, this is backed up by the evidence that we're gonna have to grind well past the point where money means anything. Which is a, a bit unfortunate. However, as a black mage, he now has 2,000 health. Butts now has 2,000 health as a black mage, and that is just, that is amazingly and ridiculous. But that also means we, mm, I'm tempted, I'm tempted to try Necrophobe, even though I really shouldn't be. Berserker is considered a low... I was reading up again on the Fiesta and I forget how they classify the classes, but uh, they do so. And some are just considered really not that great. Uh, basically they're tiered classes. And Berserker is definitely a lower tier class because of the sheer volume of problems they cause. They're not great. They have a lot of health, but that's really all they have. Um, the axes are decent weapons, but you can't. The fact that you can't control them means a lot of times in a lot of fights, you just need to kill the berserker. Which in our case would just leave one person on the field, which makes it infeasible to just kill the berserker. We still have some time to go. But we have our next Hermes sandal. Oh goodness gracious, this is gonna take some doing. Some doing indeed.
Let's see how that chicken knife is doing. It's probably pretty... Oh, that is a, that's a very strong chicken knife at this point. I think it may be Max, actually. We may have maxed out our chicken knife. I'll have to check in and see if we can gain any more numbers, but I think 255 is all it's allowed to count. In which case, the chicken knife will just be put to the side because we, we just need to grind. 10 minutes of grinding, one level, another set of Hermes sandals. Not bad, not a bad return. And actually, we might as well distribute those. We don't have need for a flame ring as of yet anyway. Did I ever restock my items? Yes, I did. Ned is going to be a pain in the butt no matter how he is fought. I mean, he is a Final Fantasy boss. I mean, the end of Final Fantasy V boss. Actually, I'm going to try something. We're going to take the bird. And we're going to go see what Phoenix Tower's like. I, maybe the experience will be better if I can find Phoenix Tower. Ah, Phoenix Tower's over this continent. It's a bit of a walk. Um, bird cannot fly into the void. Don't worry. Bird is perfectly safe from the void. Which is more than we can say for the other bird. Sadly. Walls. Poor walls. If it's not any better grinding wise, we'll probably go someplace else, but we can we can do Phoenix, I think. Oh land crawlers. Yeah, that's a very strong chicken knife. That was a that was a chicken knife. That was a brilliant chicken knife. That didn't seem like it was any better than anything. Actually, that was from the back row. We need to remember that. Um, yeah, that is, uh, that's a knife. Yeah, yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna want that. Most definitely. Um, actually, Ferris, you get the chicken knife. Okay, Phoenix Tower. What do you have for me? I don't have anything for you because you haven't been unlocked yet. Of course not. That would be ridiculous. Berserkers? 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 There we go, Berserkers. Oh, thank you, Ferris. You can't run. This means the knife will be occasionally useful. Ooh, that's not good. Well, you killed the, uh, the chicken berserker. That's not good. Oh, why would you do that? That was rude. That was rude, and that was really not worth it. Mainly due to the, uh, death of Ferris. So, uh, chicken knife. You, uh, you get to go away for a little bit. You get to, uh... Oh, dear. Oh, dear.
Oh, what have you done? Somehow we won that. This place is a silly place. Oh, right, we have max cottages. I forgot I did that. Why would I do something silly like that? Oh, right, I maxed out my cottages. I'm silly like that. Let us not go there. It is a very, very silly place. But we basically obsoleted, I think, the dancing dagger with uh, the chicken knife. Which is exactly what we're going to use in the... on the final boss. Back to the airship and the old grind zone we go. <gasps> By the way, this is Fork Tower. I thought it was a Phoenix Tower. I mistook it for because they have the same overworld sprite. And it has been a little bit of time since I played Final Fantasy V last. You'll forgive me. Won't you? So we continue. Now every battle means something. Let's do a quick test of the uh, chicken knife. And see if that gets any stronger. I don't think it has. I think it's probably maxed out at this maxed out at this point. Which will be amazing. If that's the case. We're actually doing pretty well. We're surviving a very long grind at this point. 
And I think the numbers are really starting to begin to climb. They're really cl starting to escalate, I think. Every level is going to be... start feeling very significant. Although Ferris nearly having 3k health is, is going to be very helpful. Because Meteor is, I believe, four... roughly four to five thousand dollar... dollar? Wow. Five to five thousand damage. Um... Right over four attacks, I think. So we need someone to be who can survive a little bit. Yeah, butts is. Ooh, we're gonna have a hard time hitting the goal. I really wanna. I mean, I really wanna try and hit sixty, but uh, we're not gonna get there at any decent rate. But we might get everyone to Master Black Mage, or at least well on their way to. I think we have two at this point. Which is amazing progress, by the way. <laughs> I mean, like I said, this is normally, and in a normal run of this game, this is what I would say is end game level. But, uh, that's, that's the point. Berserker makes things very awkward. Okay, everyone is currently 43. I think we're going to try again if we can hit 50. If we, if we hit 50, when we hit 50, I'm going to, we're going to try net again. Um... Not because he's particularly... Again, he's not hard, he's just... Surviving till Ned is the hardest part. Okay, and we have the next ring, so... The last and final ring, mind you. And we never have to come to Illusion Village again, Mirage Village again. Unless, that is... We want some elixirs. I did check the magic shop, right? Just for some reason it just it seems wrong. Okay, it just seems wrong. The strange bird. Good old friend Chocobo. Actually, let's get some armor while we're here. Aegis is good. Crystal Helms would be brilliant. Don't need that. Don't want that. And we want one set of crystal armor. By the black garb for comparison, because they both claim they're better than what Cryley has. I'm not sure why. Okay. Yeah, the crystal armor. Crystal helm. Right. You still have bone mail. I forgot. I'm keeping my bone mail. For reasons that... For most people are, would be... A bit odd. And look at that, we can still buy. Still buy that last ring. Yeah, we had to, I still can't believe we had to grind for flame rings in World 1. But this is going to make everyone just much faster and the grind faster. Because everyone now has haste on them, I mean everybody now. Which means nobody will be lagging behind, Ferris. Might as well stay at the inn. Sweet dreams, warriors of light. Dream of chopping down a tree. Gradually, bit by bit by bit. 
that is basically what we are doing with X-Death. Okay. We broke the 3,000 mark. That's good. Riley's getting up there. She's still a few levels behind, but she's a lot less than she used to be. That's good. That's very good. So she'll be like... 47, I think. She won't she won't be 50 when the rest of them do. Yeah, see she was uh nearly 10 levels behind there. Whereas opposed she's only four now. And so we bezoom the grind. Yeah, the the Hermes sandals are gonna help so much with the grind some point we'll probably be able to start grinding the void at least the first room or two of it the first room for sure we'll be able to start grinding it probably I want to say right around 50 if we're lucky I'll have to check to see the feasibility on it and now of course we need to remember Lena is in the bone mail she never gets out the bone mail. Although we could maybe, with equipment stacking, we could do double, double bone mail berserker. That would actually be pretty smart, which means I need to afford one more piece of armor for her to wear when she's not bone mailing. That actually sounds like that might work. That actually might work. That might be a way to help mitigate the problems of X death of Neo X death, as you saw. Um, he is he's just got so many strong abilities. I'm just hoping that all this extra armor will, well, it seems to be adding to our strength. Okay, Butt says Butts and Ferris have now reached the next level. Yes. If we can break 4k health, we might have a shot at this. Maybe. I mean, the Hermes Sandals will be the determining factor if the Hermes Sandals and Flame Ring stack. And the transition is not an impenetrable field. So that's the problem. It could be that uh, the cutscene, whatever it will be left of it, could be a stopping barrier between carrying over the effects. Which could be a bit unusual, but not unexpected. I'm sorry, if I'd known this is what Berserker Risk meant, I mean, I knew it was going to include possibly multiple Berserkers, but I was expecting two tops. Two tops and one other possible something to allow me to perform some gimmick, but there is no gimmick. Triple Berserker means there is no gimmick. Okay, everyone has another level under their belt. Good. And we are still in perfect health. Okay. We are now going to check whether or not this is going to work. Everyone, put on your flame rings. Oh, that means we can't use the elven mantles either. But, you get unmad. And you take that stupid thing off.
And now we see if it worked. I mean, they, these things literally can't hurt us anymore. Okay. Actually, yes, I noticed our ATB, ATP gauges were really high up there. But yes, this works. This straight up works. Let's see if it works better the other direction, though. It might work better in the other direction. I may have just doomed Lena to death. If this will work. Will this work? Okay, it doesn't quite work that way. Uh, no. No, it does not. That is very odd. It should work like that. Everything I've heard says it just should work. Hmm. Well, I guess... That's supposed to work. Maybe it doesn't work on accessories. God, I wish I'd kept that flame shield now. That is an actually good question. Are there places to find them? There's gotta be places to find flame shields. There we go, items. Flame shield. And... They're not buyable? <sighs> there are only two flame shields in the game, aren't there? Of course there are. Of course there are. Why would there not be? Why would there not be? Yeah, there's nothing in here that's helpful. And I'm looking at all this other stuff that's around. None of it's helpful. A lot of bonus dungeon stuff, actually. Okay, here we go. Hermy sandals. Flame rings.
Hmm. Well. There's nothing we can really utilize. Sadly. We have... Nothing we can do. Well, that was, um, unfortunate. I nearly wiped the party on a stupid gimmick that apparently does not work. Aegis might. That would be something to test. A test at a later time. We'll test it on X-Death himself. But for now, more of a grind. I forgot to put uh, butts back into a uh, full grind mode. There we go. Butts, you, you leave that knife alone. You know that is not good for you. Yeah, the goal, actually, of this stream is to get to level 55. I think that's a pretty good stopping point. It's a pretty nice round number, too. But if we can get to 50, we can st try to start grinding inside the void. Which will save us a few experience, which means... Actually, at this point, it'll save us entire battles. Yeah. And Butts is actually getting close to uh, clearing out Black Mage. Which means it'll be, I believe, Kryle's time. Yeah, Kryle is the only one who doesn't has not mastered Black Mage. But Butts gained a level. Actually, what can help with the grind? I don't know why I didn't think of this. It is turning the battle and uh, the speeds up. That won't save much time in the grand scheme of things. But it does mean we'll get through them... We'll get... We'll get through them faster. Yeah, I can't even see what the uh, numbers, what the words say up there anymore. All I know is that there was a sword dance and attempting tango happened. It's definitely going to speed up the grind. And anything you can do to speed up your necessary grind is going to be very beneficial. Oh, Kryle is about to break 3k, so that, that'll actually make her make the entire party a lot more survivable when Kryle breaks 3k. As it is, these enemies are not really able to touch us much. 
I mean, if I didn't need the golden hairpin, Butts would definitely be wearing the circlet. I'm just saddened that I, I didn't grab that flame shield. Oh, Ferris is now level 49. Now, in any sensible party, you would not have to fiesta this hard. You would not have to fiesta anywhere near this hard. Okay, status. What are we looking at? 34,000. Oh, but you did master your job. Good. Lena. Or is it cry? It's cryly. You get to be the black mage with the star. And you get to be berserked. But you do not get that knife. And but you are once again a berserker. With extra mana. For no reason other than you can. And Cryly, you give that knife over. Notice how... Okay, right. She is also a lot lower of a level. And I think... Yeah, Butts now has the highest health. Okay, we can compare some stats between similarly leveled Berserkers. Butts has higher strength, higher stamina, lower magic, lower defense, and slightly less magic defense. Ferris, on the other hand, is slightly weaker... Slightly less stamina, but has more agility. Much more magic. Less defense. Just very interesting to see the... Ah, uh, one of those was... One of those reasons was bone mail. I forget bone mail is a thing. It is a thing. But I'm going to do something silly. Let's see how grinding in the void is. I mean, we have gained several more levels. That poor lost town. The void. Temporarily. Void should be over here-ish. Down here-ish. It's always confusing. 
back into the void. Again, if we can grind here, this will save us some levels. Forget, is there anything useful in the airship? No, there is not. There isn't even a, a healing and save point. He should... Okay, he can still harm us. Not that he has any reason to. Okay, eggs. How bad are these things? Oh, right, these things can still earthquake. Yeah, these things are not something we want to... Yeah, we definitely don't want to be here. Yeah, we definitely do not want to be here. That was a not-so-smart idea. Sadly. Like many Fiesta ideas, it is worth as much a shot as anything else. And we have... We have like 520 bal battles before. Riley maxes out Black Mage. We have plenty of AP to go. Actually, if they're getting two AP, then that means we have only 200. But I think I've answered my question. No, grinding in the void is not a possibility at this time. Which is the saddest thing in the world, to be honest. But I think we'll be able to afford elixirs like no one's business by the time the grind to 55 is over. We should probably be able to hit it by the end of the, the today. And I'm hoping Ned is going to be a... I mean, he's not going to be a cakewalk. There's no way around it. Ned is never a cakewalk. But he should be manageable at some point. I'm hoping to try and do it before hitting 70, but if 55 doesn't do it, we may need to hit level 70. Which is going to be a pain in the real, a real pain. At least the enemies die fast. That's about the only good thing about it. Oh, Cryley is a little low on health. Time to heal up at the inn and see where we're at. Oh, good. You guys have hit level 49. You guys are still at level 49. Pardon me. I thought you may have hit to uh, your 48. But yes, we will try X-Death at 50. I don't anticipate it going well. But we will have, we do have some survivability compared to last time. Um, yeah, most people will be at 3,500. Yeah, actually, Cryley being a black mage is not going to hurt her chances. It's not going to harm our chances too terribly much because she's still going to have... 2,000-ish health. So we got plenty of goodness. Plenty of great goodness going on. Okay, Butts is now level 50. Now we just need the other two to catch up. Neither one of them has yet. Nope, still no other 50 Berserkers. Oh, 
Oh, come on, berserkers. 50. Come on, you guys can hit level 50. I know you can. Come on, berserker. There's not butts. Which even then, he gained 175 health. 160, I think, actually, but... Oh, Kryly has now mastered that. And now we just need Lena to get to 50. And she needs a lot of experience to do so. So at least like 16 more battles. Oh good, she's almost there. Good. This grind is starting to get to me again. We spent nearly an hour on it and we've gotten... Oh, I think that was our level. Nope. Nope, not yet. Oh, but this is starting to wear on me a little again. Come on, Lana. Lana, come on. And just the sheer health will... should make a huge difference in how that fight goes. With how the Ned fight goes. There we go. Turbo mode off. And a save state all across. 23,000, 230,000, excuse me. We could afford four more elixirs. And then we could just throw them around willy-nilly. <sighs> or... Actually, don't... If we could get... If we could grind off of Iron Giant. In theory, we could, because we have plenty of cottages. You know, that's... That's a possibility now. That is a definite possibility. We just have to make it. Okay, Cryley. You get to come out of Berserker State. You get to equip your axes. Mangus Rod. Ferris. Cup the chicken. And so... We resume our trudge to X-Death. Those guys are most definitely not worth it. Even though they do die very quickly. Sadly, not fast enough. Things still hurt here.
While there's no reason to power up the chicken knife, there are always reasons to run. I don't think this is a good idea. I really don't. Five thousand damage knife. The power of cowardice will see us through to the end. We are likely going to be able to just survive. Thanks to the cowardice and the sheer level of health a berserker has. That is why, despite not being called so, in Final Fantasy XIV, a warrior is a berserker. We were fortunate there, level 5 death did not kill anyone. And we still have no way to deal with good friend Omega. Good friend Omega is still friend to everyone. And hatred of... I'm not sure what he's a hater of, what have I said? Garula is a hater of monarchs. I think I think Omega is just a tech roman a um techocracy of some description. He he would be very much in support of he would be very much in support of Deus Ex's ending before human um not human revolution invisible war screwed up the entire ending by making it all canon. All of it. That knife is now so beautiful. This might not be a bad grinding place. We'll need to keep this in mind. On top of that, things actually can't really harm us in here. I knew the force was good. I just didn't think it was quite this good. At least I don't remember it being this good. I think we have 5,000 damage chicken knife. That, that is going to be our secret weapon. I don't think we brought Chicken Knife to the last Ned fight. I don't remember why, but we didn't. Oh yeah, the other nice thing about Berserker. They cannot be confused. Though that is going to be a problem with the Chicken Knife. Still, it is like five times as powerful as Butts' knife. So it's still pretty good. Even if it only misses, it's like one in four. It's still an overall improvement. We 
Ooh, that knife. That knife is so far brilliant. Good friend Omega. He just wants to take a bath. Oh, you. You're mean, you know that, Arkelion. Thank you, Butts, for not killing that instantly. Feel free to run at any time, Ferris. Fifteen hundred, fifteen hundred experience. Not, not horrible. Notice I haven't gone through a single high potion yet. Things have just stopped hurting us. Probably because we stopped running away. It's really weird like that sometimes. When it's just easier to just kill them. It's... I don't get this. Although chicken knife does still... It is still the chicken knife. Okay, that still hurts us, but less than you would think. Because everything's just gotten much stronger. Our numbers are climbing up there pretty, pretty rapidly. Okay, bots, I guess you don't get he to be healed. That is the reason I'm contemplating not duplicating. <laughs> I mean, as much as I want to not duplicate, duplicate the effects of the chicken knife and the Aegis shield because it's just... It's caused a lot of hassle when it comes to trying to heal yourself. It Sometimes I wonder if it's even worth it to even have because it just, it breaks the healing cycle and that's not good when you're reliant on your black mage. I mean, look at that, he ca he's, he's dying, slowly. And there he goes again. Chicken Knife once again does what Chicken Knife does. I didn't think there was anything out of those passages, but you never really know. We have a much better possibility of surviving. Oh, probability, actually. Because although everything still hits for the same amount, we have not quite double, but we have like an extra third of our health that wasn't there before. Though that chicken knife.
use a cottage and see about grinding some of these guys into paste. Oh, okay, how are you? Oh, you guys. I remember you, and I don't even have the guide up to look up your data. They're not hard. Despite the boss, the- Oh, you absorb that. Oh, well, it's a good thing berserkers are rather tough. <laughs> Isn't it? Oh, you did not. You figured out my gimmick. How dare you figure out my gimmick? I mean, oh. Oh, I mean, they figured out that I have a gimmick. My gimmick is I've got one controllable party member. Yay. Berserker. Berserker. Uh, oh, really? Oh, can't escape, so it's uh, up to you, Berserkers. I've been deleted. My input means nothing. Okay, the Yura Avis has 15,000 health, and his first form has six. Both of them are pretty not very helpful. I mean, they're pretty weak. Oh, well, thank you, I guess. I mean, I didn't really need the bone bone zerker here. Okay, and it just absorbs all my elements, so I guess we can just poison it. Although it's a little harder with Ferris trying to escape constantly. Still, oh, that's... that's manageable. Oh, thank you. Red Slippers is part of the Dancer set. In fact, I'm probably going to replace someone's equipment with the Rune Axe just for the extra criticals. I'm thinking it's going to be the Thor's Hammer, unless the Thor's Hammer is just that good, which I don't think it is. And Kryli has now job level 6. He's got one more job level 450 job points. And with any luck, she'll either get it from 
She'll either get it from the grind, or she won't need get it at all. In which case, we will have an unfulfilled master party. Rainbow dress, which is, I believe, the other piece of dancer equipment. Yes, indeed. You get to live, old man. You get to live. To the Iron Giants. Let me see what, uh, what the Iron Giants are all about. They are moderate. Oddly enough, not immune to instant death. Somehow. They have no type. I mean, literally no type. Well, this is why we don't grind in this area, because of Furies and Death Claws. You guys can keep your equipment, it's all useless to me. Yeah, I had no chance there. I had one move to input. You will let us escape. They are just mean and evil creatures. They are mean and evil creatures. Let's see, we don't... Arr, I forgot. Are they immune to that? They are not. Oddly enough, uh, Iron Giants, by the way, have 18,000 health, but they hurt like a truck. They are not worth it to grind off of. They are not worth a grind. Question is, can we kill Necrophobe? Have to. Otherwise... Our good friend Greg will never be truly on his way. Yes, we must kill the necrophobe. And King Behemoth here. Is... Despite... Having 18,000 health, his, Im his immunities are quite, quite small. You could possibly grind him with the right party. 
we are not the right party. Although we could petrify him whenever he shows up. Which is a chance which would be acceptable, actually. I'm once again why I'm trying to go to these lengths when I know we don't have the levels needed to take on take on Ned. I know we don't. And even if we do, I don't have the endurance necessary to take on Ned at this time. Thankfully, flame rings apparently negate frost as well, which is a nice move. Cryley has once again gained her black level 6. Jinryu. Oh, come on now. This is just rude. Rude. Very, very rude. Mind flayers. Very rude. Oh, don't you start this again. Thank you, Ferris. They were being so very rude. Why were they so rude? That was just so rude. By the way, if we kill Necrophobe, we are technically saving. Because I want that save point. Okay, everyone, down some high potions. Actually, Necrophobe won't be too much of an issue. He shouldn't be, anyway. With the health we have. He should... This should go pretty smooth, actually. Hopefully I got that input on the right timing. Yeah, a thousand health. We can actually take a couple of those. I mean, we can't take them indefinitely. And if my timing is not great, or the Aegis kicks off, or Holy lands on the Bone Zerker. Fortunately, it isn't. And I've, if the Aegis continues to kick off every time I try and heal them. Okay, yeah. Actually, these barriers are going to die super fast. There's the healing. Yeah, that one's half dead. There's at least two of them that are half dead.
Let's see if we got that in on the right timing. We did. Everyone will survive this, more than likely. Unless they both target- unless Cryley gets targeted twice. To be unfortunate. Oli finally got blocked by the Aegis. That was your last chance to survive this, Ferris. If it had dealt three fewer health damage to Cryley, we could have killed Necrophobe. so so very close to necrophobe but unfortunately it is as i suspected not enough the levels are still insufficient but we're very close to at least being able to horribly murder necrophobe which is exactly what we need to do at least what i want to do so 55 is a po distinct possibility. We might be able to survive Ned at level 55, mainly due to the increased health more than anything else. Being able to just absorb more damage. I mean, especially when it comes to our healer having to survive likely alone. A meteor. I mean, it's not likely to be, you know, alone alone, but Meteor is an annoying spell. We're unlikely to hit level 55 today. Although... 
begin at like 52, we'll be have a reason to call it a day. And we've proven in concept we can at least finish this fiesta today, uh, this week. And we had to have until the end of August to do another fiesta, which is likely to include less grinding, but more shenanigans. Some of those may be time-consuming shenanigans. Especially if they involve Fork Tower at all, which in all likelihood it will. Because if any of them involve Summoner, well, such will be the case. I think we will do... I will... Yes, we will attempt one more Fiesta run this month if we can finish by Friday. I'd love to finish by Thursday, but we both, we all know that is not likely to be the case. But has reached level 51 and is right on the verge of 4k. Actually, he is just about 4k. He's a few points off, I think. Jokes about technology! If you haven't gotten that, 4K is not literally 4,000. Much like a... Much like much in computers, the numbers are a over-exaggeration and oversimplification of an approximation. Because computers deal in numbers of two, um, thus a full gigabyte is actually 1024? Yes, 1024, because half a gigabyte is 512. But, due to shenanigans of numbers, a terabyte is 960 gigabytes, rather than the 1000 advertised. Number shenanigans. It is... It is life. It is all around everyone. All your numbers are shenanigans. These numbers in this game, we're, we're dealing with the shenanigans. We have not been playing for 36 hours, but it sure right now is feeling like it. My stamina drains fast. Although, I, I can't believe we nearly had Necrophobe. If the Berserkers had RNG'd a little better, we would have had him. He would have been dead. Necrophobe would have been dead. I mean, we nearly took out one of his his barriers the first turn. It's just every, the damage was just so small, just spread out that it just wasn't gonna gonna handle it. I don't know why. The mysteries of berserkers. The mystery of the berserker. Everyone's now level 51. We can no longer return to Necrophobe. Just remember, next time I decide to take on Necrophobe like that in a long drawn out RNG based battle, to save. And this is probably fairly close. I mean, you can see what's going on. As I as I've mentioned, this is just the final. We're gonna we're gonna try it at 55. You know, at the worst case scenario, we're gonna start at heading towards Ned at 9:30 tomorrow, and with whatever level we have, you know. Because, let's be honest, I it, this fiesta is ready to be over. I want I want some new shenanigans. Rather than just Black Mage's Hero of the Universe. Because it kept the, the Berserkers alive. And I, want, I wanted a world too that was more than just Deathsickle does all the work everywhere all the time. But that is roughly what it, it leveled out to.
Ah, Cryley is well on her way to mastering. Mastering her final job. Butts is really close to level 52. It's just Lena that's kind of fallen behind. Oh, in a relative sense. The level 51's Lena's the furthest behind, so we can stop when she gets to level 52. Butts and Ferris are both much closer, as is Cryley. Cryley will likely hit level 50. By the time everyone else hits level 52. Come on. Oh, Cradley game to level. That's good. And so did Butts. Two more levels to go. And I know it's going to be calling it early, but once again, the grind just kind of gets into you. It makes you a little on the tired side. Which is unfortunate, because, let's be honest, other than the grind here, if I hadn't... If I didn't have a reason to grind so much, i say a much more balanced party... We, we would have killed Exeth a long time ago. Unfortunately, the party we have is... quite unbalanced. And this is the possibility for the next fiesta as well. He is just butts is like very shy of hitting an actual 4K health. That is disappointing. Come on, Lena. Okay, she's got like 10 battles in her. Meanwhile, Cryley is almost... We almost have a complete set of... Mastered and mastered uh, jobs. That is not very normal. One last battle. We'll have it at normal speed. Just outside Jacol. And it's a triple frog encounter. Maybe I can see what's been healing us this whole time. That's what's been doing it. I should have suspected it was Jitterbug. Frogs are not worth much experience. I should have expected that. Hmm. Oh, there's 720. There's what's technically considered HD. Even though HD is actually 1080. But... Come on, frogs. I just need Lena to get one last level up. 
And then we can call it for the day. Come on, frogs. Or anything, anything other than frogs would also work. Frogs explain why the grind was taking so long. I mean, 300 experience a pop? Ugh. Seriously. I just, it's, she has 60. We could go kill Nutkins and get her a level faster than these frogs. There we go. Level 52 Berserkers. And that chicken knife is going to do us so good. It's going to be ridiculous. But that will be for next time. Tomorrow on Thursday. 9.30, we head for X-Death. Try and murder him. Try and murder us a tree. Because there's nothing else for us to do that I feel comfortable doing. <laughs> because there's actually nothing I can do because I don't have the ability to get a reflect ring at all. That's the worst part of it. It's like, reflect rings. You can't purchase them. I missed out on my opportunity to do Orc Tower. Till then, folks. Till tomorrow. For X-Death at 9.30. Grind at 8.30. See you then.